Hey guys, what's up and welcome to another week of building the battle of Geonosis in LEGO. This week we're making some major expansions on the mock, building a ton of new terrain, and as you can see here, lots of ATTs and Clone Troopers on here, so the mock has definitely grown a lot. But without further ado, let's just dive into it to this week's of Building Geonosis and LEGO, and make sure to subscribe. New episodes are coming out every weekend if you want to stay up to date on this super large scale Battle Geonosis mock, but let's get into it. So to start this week's episode of building Geonosis in Lego, I split the tables in the two here. As we can see here is the sections that we are working on at the moment, building up to the canyon and hill portion. And I went ahead and built out a ton of these 16 by 16 plates on here to be able to get a, like a basic frame of how we want to build this. And then I went ahead and also built the side border. Hopefully by the time we're done here this week, this whole section will be complete and we'll be building more up into the hillside. But I think we're gonna start right over here with this hillside and just get a basic layout of where the angles are all going to fit. And then we'll also be able to continue the work on the rock structures and everything moving forward throughout it. So without further ado, let's get to building. So after a while building, I have built the ground floor of these next two sections, as well as built up a little bit of the remaining hill that's gonna keep going up all the way here and connect it to this portion. And then we have this little rock structure that's gonna be the very tip point of the next uh, like rock wall piece that's gonna go all the way through. And then we'll actually angle this way. But the one cool thing I actually decided to do over here is I want to implement everything uh, that you can imagine from different Star Wars media in Geonosis. Instead of making it just like the Battlefront 2 2017 map, I want to make this area like the Battlefront 2 OG 2005 map. Now I just laid out some bricks here, not actually what it's going to look like, but where the uh, initial clone spawn point in the Geonosis uh, Desert Plains map is going to be. So this is where that's going to be. It's going to be more of like a circular structure here with a clone little outpost in here, which I think is gonna look really, really cool. This entire section over here is gonna be Battlefront 2 2005 themed and then kind of moving on over here as well. Cause I think I might move this specific uh, module over into another section. So I think this is look really cool when I actually get more built. But like I said, this is all complete down here. But now I can continue to kind of work more on this area and kind of figure out where everything's gonna go. And then we continue to build upwards. I went ahead and placed the basic layout of the clone base here that they've kind of taken over from the droids. Now this is going to be obviously, like I said earlier, based off of Star Wars Battlefront 2 and being the spawn point. And it is kind of a circular design as I'll show here. And that's what I've kind of put the bare basics of what this is going to look like. And as you can see, I put some 16 by 16 plates on the sides. This is just the very, like I said, bare bones. It will look way, way better once it's actually done. But I'm just giving you an idea of how this looks like before I actually get to the major building and then I went ahead and placed all of these 16 by 16 plates here that we're gonna go ahead and fill up with more tile and plates go ahead and get this area all complete and then what I'm thinking is I'm actually going to add another just one gray base plate in between this section and then this section so this section like I said earlier move it up add another base plate because I want a little bit more separation between this trench area over here that we built at the very beginning and the clone outpost here and I think that'll be very nice. So without further ado, let's get the building on the terrain
So after many hours of building, I have added five more base plates to the mock here of Geonosis. It's quite insane how it's expanding on such a major way this episode. So let's dive into all the progress that I built here. So first things first is I continued to build out the previous section that we had with the future clone command post built into this Geonosian bunker. I built out more of the terrain, added some more rock work and all that sort of fun stuff. But I didn't want to continue to build too much more around it. So I don't know exactly how big the clone command post is going to be and how it's going to, far it's going to build out. So I kind of kept it more bare around there. But the big thing is I added a completely new section of this two uh, gray base plate section, which is just purely Geonosis uh, terrain with different varied slopes and tiles and plates, as well as some different medium nougat rock work that goes all throughout it. So I set out all these 16 by 16 plates and then began to tile it off. Now this is a great buffer section from the droid outpost here that the clones have taken over. And then we have the trench area we have on the further side, which I pushed up to kind of get it more into the battlefield because I want clone troopers and stuff hiding out here and rushing up into the battle. So just like you see in the Battlefront 2 OG uh, map, you have this little hill, the little rubber, little ri dried riverbed on the bottom here. And then there'll be some kind of droid control ship, maybe crash down here with a command post. Just an idea of maybe something I want to add, or either a Battlefront 1 inspired uh, droid command post kind of up here as well. I also built some different kind of rocks, again, inspired by the OG Battlefront 2 that you got to hide behind and clone troopers can take cover. But the main idea of this being it's kind of more a generic uh, build here is a lot of uh, ATTEs and gunships are going to be landing on this section of the build. So I wanted to not make anything too crazy. Just a slight elevation in the terrain here because uh, gunships and ATTEs and clone troopers are all going to be marching up just like you see in a attack of the clone. So that was kind of the main idea in just here. But overall, so happy how this connects to the rest of the build. And you can kind of see how it's not going to be pushing more that forward and also backwards. So we have a ton to do in this mock series to go lots more building, which is insane that this is already um, pretty massive so far. So guys, you definitely want to be make sure to subscribe. They'll be here every week to see the continuation of this Geonosis mock. But before we go, I want to add some of the gunships and ATTEs on this area to give you an idea of how the vehicles are going to work on at least on this section of the build. Well, let's get to it. And here's what the monk looks like with four ATTEs and one gunship just in the very beginning section of what we have built here on Geonosis. I actually have two more ATTEs that are not built yet, the new 2022 uh, versions, but I might need to get more. And hopefully Lego comes out with a new gunship in the future for this mock because I definitely am going to need a lot more. And it fits the vehicles pretty comfortably. They're not too crammed close to each other, just like I want it to go through the whole entire battle scene where we have more ATTEs kind of flushing through here. And then we get to like the front line portion of the mock. And then we're gonna have all the droid forces, but we have a lot more to go with that. But thank you guys so much for watching. That's gonna be it for building Geonosis and Lego. I think next week we're gonna be continuing the work on uh, moving the smock more this way, continuing to build on this clone outpost that they've taken over this Geonosis outpost. That's gonna be a fun task. And then continuing the heel section that's gonna run all the way up to this vast canyon area. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching this episode of Building Geonosis and Lego. And I'll see y'all next time.